Hello everyone. As we already know that how to find out the rational numbers, here in question number 7, we have to find 5 rational numbers between 3 by 5 and 4 by 5. We already know that the denominators are same, so we can directly write 3.1 upon 5, 3.2 upon 5, 3.3 upon 5, 3.4 upon 5, 3.5 upon 5, and so on. All these numbers when the numerator is more than 3 and less than 4 are all the rational numbers in between these two rational numbers. To 3.1 upon 5, I can write 31 upon 50. To 3.2 upon 5, I can write 32 upon 50. Then it is 33 upon 50 and so on. So instead of 5 rational numbers, we can put any number of rational numbers in between the two. Next is insert 10 rational numbers between minus 2 upon 5 and 1 upon 7. Here again, First of all, the important thing is we have to equate the basis or the denominators. Here the denominator is 5, here it is 7. If I multiply 7 upon 7 in this rational number and 5 upon 5 in this rational number, we will come to a conclusion that this is minus 14 upon 35, while this fraction is 5 upon 30. Now, all the numbers between minus 14 and 5 in the numerator and 35 in the denominator is a rational number between these two fractions or these two rational numbers. So minus 13 upon 35, minus 12 upon 35, minus 11 upon 35 and till 4 upon 35. All the numbers are the numbers which are between these two rational numbers. Next question is find 6 rational numbers between 1 upon 2 and 2 upon 3. Again, we can equate the basis to 1 upon 2, I can write 3 upon 6. To 2 upon 3, I can write 4 upon 6. What I am doing is, I am multiplying 3 upon 3 into this and 2 upon 2 into this to equate the denominators. Once the denominators are equal, again 3.1 upon 6, 3.2 upon 6, 3.3 upon 6 and all these numbers where the numerator is between 3 and 4 and the denominator is 6 is between these two rational numbers. To this I can write 31 upon 60. This is 32 upon 60. This is 33 upon 60. And we can also cancel out these numbers to make it in the, in the lowest format. It is 8 upon 15. If I cancel it by 4 on both sides, it cannot be cancelled out. That means it is 31 upon 60. If I cancel these two, it becomes 11 upon 20. And all these numbers are, all these rational numbers are between these two rational numbers. So, in this exercise, we have learned that in between two rational numbers, there are infinite number of rational numbers which are possible. Because if I am writing 3.1 upon 5, to this I can also write 3.11 upon 5. Because 3.11 is also between 3 and 4. And to this I can write 311 upon 500. This is also a rational number between 3 by 5 and 4 by 5. One of the best methods for this can be, which is not only which the teachers don't teach in the school or they don't tell in the school, is we can add directly the numerators and the denominators, here it is 3 upon 5, it is 4 upon 5, adding the numerators becomes 7 and adding the denominators becomes 10. So it is clear that 7 upon 10 is a fraction which is between 3 upon 5 and 4 upon 5. If I have to write one more fraction between 3 upon 5 and 7 upon 10, so 3 plus 7 is 10, 5 upon 10, 5 plus 10 is 15. So 10 upon 15 is also a fraction which is more than 3 upon 5 and less than 4 upon 5. In this way, we can also find out a lot of number of rational numbers in between the two rational numbers. This is another way of doing it. Thank you.